Future announces a new album, Harry Styles gets his COVID-19 charity on, and a music legend loses his life to the coronavirus. First up, Future is the latest superstar to don the cover of XXL Mag, and from his scope, life is good. According to the rapper, his Drake-assisted single will also double as the title for his upcoming album. Of the new project, he said it's about life and being good and just enjoying life. Next up, Harry Styles is celebrating World Health Day by offering fans a new t-shirt with a special Sign of the Times message about being safe during the current coronavirus pandemic. The shirt says, stay home, stay safe, protect each other on the front, and this t-shirt fights COVID-19 and his signature catchphrase, treat people with kindness on the back. In a statement announcing the sale for the $26 t-shirt, Harry wrote, in times like these, it is more important than ever to remember the power of people. If you're able to help, please donate where you can. 100% of the profits of this t-shirt will go towards fighting COVID-19, stay home, self-isolate, and protect each other. And lastly, on Tuesday, April 7th, Americana legend and singer-songwriter John Prine passed away at 73 years old from complications of COVID-19. His death comes just a few weeks after his family revealed his diagnosis. Since John's self-titled debut arrived in February of 1971, the Songwriters Hall of Famer landed 15 albums on the Billboard 200 chart and worked with fellow legends like Chris Christopherson, Bob Dylan, and cowboy Jack Clement. Pictures have big ears. Don't stop to count the years. And the two-time Grammy-winning artist's songs, including Sam Stone, Hello In There, Paradise, and more have been admired and covered by countless artists. So to no surprise, the music world stormed social media to mourn the loss of a great. Hello In There. Bruce Springsteen wrote, John and I were new Dylans together in the early 70s, and he was never anything but the loveliest guy in the world, a true national treasure and a songwriter for the ages. For more on these stories and all things music, head to Billboard.com. And until next time, for Billboard News, I'm Chelsea Briggs.